More skeletons stumble out in the Chinese espionage racket that led to the arrest of an Indian journalist, a Chinese woman and a Nepalese national. As per sources, the Chinese national Kin Shi was asked to get details of top officials and bureaucrats who were working in important ministries. For this, Kin Shi was introduced to a woman in Kolkata sometime in late 2019. In fact, uh, she was told that the woman will give her documents in English and she has to translate it to Mandarin. Sources claim Indian journalist Rajiv Sharma was also in constant touch with Kin Shi. Bhavtosh uh, joining me on the phone line. Bhavtosh, now a lot of details coming in. If you can help us put things in context for our viewers, uh, along with uh, the background to this entire case, we are now saying that there is more damning information coming in on the Chinese espionage racket. After the uh, last month, uh, the Delhi police special cell had arrested a journalist, Sagi Sharma, and also a Chinese woman, uh, uh, Kinshi, and her partner, and a police uh, citizen, uh, Sher Bahadur uh, Singh. Now, uh, they had claimed that uh, Quincy was running a, a company, a shell company, from which uh, illegal money transaction was taking place. But during the questioning, it has now been found that uh, Quincy was also very active in the espionage racket being run by the Chinese establishment. In fact, uh, a, a monk had uh, introduced her to a woman uh, who was uh, from a very prominent uh, uh, Kolkata business family. Uh, the monk, in fact, told her that this woman will give her a list of all important officials who are working in key ministries and departments of the government and uh, what work they do. Uh, this document was in English and was handed over to Quincy. And then subsequently she translated it in Chinese and sent it uh, back to her country. Uh, this document was received by Chinese security establishment. Uh, this uh, this revelation, this important revelation happened during the questioning of Quincy. In fact, post that, uh, several teams from, uh, from Delhi Police Special Cell as well as intelligence agencies had gone to different parts of the country to question and also inquire uh, with people who were closely associated uh, with uh, with this Chinese woman. Now, uh, uh, sources in the special cell have said that uh, while scanning through her uh, okay. electronic gadgets, which included two laptops and at least six uh, mobile phones, they found that she also had the uh, e-tender of of a, of a project which was which was to be commissioned by the Kolkata's International Airport, and they have said that this information has been uh, shared with central intelligence agencies. All right, Bhaktosh, thanks for giving us the important details of this case.